Welcome back to Flat Out, everyone. This is episode 9, I believe. And uh, in the last episode, we got to the Gold Cup. We actually ran a couple races there. So um, we finally made it to the Gold Cup. It's uh, It's been a, quite a long journey here. Well, we got a little bit of money in the bank. Um, honestly, I feel like we should just race a couple races here. Just get on across here before we tune stuff, and then we'll have a lot of money, and we can just tune a whole heck of a lot of stuff. So we've got um, Red Pine River. This is a new one. Looks kind of like Whitefish Lake, but Red Pine River and the Red Pine Race Dash. There's only three laps, so I'm assuming the track might be kind of long. But yeah, it pretty much looks like Whitefish Lake, honestly. But um, I don't know. Maybe it's something I'll be different in. Something's got to be different. It's named different. We'll go right around through here, I believe. This is snowbank. Oh, yes, and we have an actual paved road. Is it going to have grip? Uh, it doesn't feel like it has very much grip. That's why I didn't go flying over that hill. I'm gonna take it real easy around this road here. Because I don't know this track. I haven't raced. I haven't raced it. If I've raced it before, it's been a very long time, so I'm kinda worried about where things might be placed. Where the jumps and stuff are, and uh, sharp turns and whatnot. There's a real sharp turn right here. Oh, these turns make me nervous. F your mailbox. And I think, uh, yep. That's one lap, so sweet. Pretty long track, but doesn't seem like it's too hard, really. The snow always uh, throws you off. Just zero traction. Oh, I might take it a little too fast that time. But we're okay, thankfully. Got a decent sized lead at least. I know I'm not going very fast through here, but I I really don't want to wreck in all this snow. It'd be uh, stupid of me to just floor it and fly through all that stuff when there's really nobody even behind me. I mean, not not close to me anyway. Or handles the, handles the snow pretty good, really. Better than the last one did. Doesn't seem to get quite as sideways as easy. Alright, final lap. Don't fly over the hill. Good little gas through here this time. Up the snowbank, and that's why that's why I don't go too fast through here. Yep, that's exactly why I don't go too fast. All right, we gotta go before we get losing lead. So if you ever wanna know why I don't just go balls to the wall all the time, that's why. Because as soon as I get the notion to do it, something happens and I am taking myself out. just can't race like this or like that on this game. The title's flat out but it only means half throttle apparently. But we won so that's good. Look at my tailpipe how crushed up it is not around anymore. Oh jeez. Good lord. It's like Kyle Busch in Daytona. All right uh, let's see. We got another three thousand dollars there. We are rolling in the money now nine thousand one hundred. We're going to go ahead and uh, race here at uh, Brad's Sand Pit at the Sand Run and try to uh, get a first place on it. So far, this is pretty easy, but I think once we get down to the second tier, it's going to be a little tougher. Second time I've tried to race this track, and the uh, first time didn't go so well. Try it again here. 
getting wrecked on the initial start, spun around, and having your guy fly out and get put back in eighth place is uh, not good. So. So far, it's going a little better. I think I've knocked every piece of glass my car has it out. But, uh... Oh, jeez. Oh, good lord. We're still in second. The car's bouncing like crazy, but... I always want to go right right there for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, let's see if we can get back in the lane here. Oh, I hate it when this thing starts bouncing like this. Yeah, he's definitely outrunning us right now. Don't hit that again. I'm talking to the car, you know, like it's listening to me. And I went the wrong way because the uh, barriers were busted up. And it looked like that's where I was supposed to go. Can we catch second? Probably not, he's uh, going quite a bit faster than we are. And I have no boost. I'm gonna go straight. Screw it. That was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Get off the thing! Yep, because I went straight. I'm going to lose third and finish fourth. <sighs> when will I learn? Don't take shortcuts. So, a bit of money from that one, but not a whole lot. Uh, yes, I know. i got to place at least third. Um, hmm. Might as well go ahead and uh, finish out this last one here. we got a fourth here. Yeah. We'll finish out the uh, Hayville Farm and the Hayville Haystacker. And, uh, I don't know, maybe we can get first here. It looks like a dirt road, which usually uh, works good for me. So, sharp right-hander here. Oh, boy. Got people flying out of their cars. Fish telling. Man, this track is crazy. This track has got some crazy turns. Straighten back out. And real, real tight, tight, sharp turns. Just right here, man, that is nuts. I mean, it's good for me because they're messing up on them, but dang, if I mess up just a little bit, it's gonna be bad. Like this right here, too fast. That's what I mean, bad.
I heard somebody fall out of the car. Somewhere. There he is. Oh, and the leader just wrecked. Awesome. This track is crazy. Minimize mistakes. That's the best way to win on road courses. Famous words about Marcus Ambrose, or Marcos Ambrose. And he's right, because you can minimize mistakes better than the next guy, then you'll win every time. As long as you're fairly quick. like that mistake that I just made, but I recovered nicely. <laughs> I don't know if that was another car or what that was, but it sounded like somebody hit something real hard behind me. <laughs> This race should be almost over now. And we're done. By the way, I try to mention in every episode, and I don't think I have in this one yet, uh, you will hear wheel noise. I don't have a way of making that wheel noise quieter, so I apologize for that because I know it can get annoying. I, I do the best I can with it, but uh, the microphone picks up a lot of wheel noise, so I do apologize for that. So, we won that race, and uh, we're going to go uh, to the last one here, uh, which is going to be Red Pine Zero Course. Uh, I'll be right back. i got to check something real quick. Okay, sorry about that. I needed to check and see how long the video had been running for. So, um... I guess we'll go to Red Pine Zero, but the thing is, we need to update the car to make these second tier races. So let's go uh, over to uh, tuning and go ahead and see if we can do some work. I, I want to get, um, I don't want to get this because I think the clutch really helps out a lot. And I want to get suspension. Uh, and I want to get some tires. And I want to get some uh, tires and brakes, I guess. Now let's get some engine work done. So we got, wow, that adds a lot of horsepower right there. Twelve thousand dollars for turbo would add a ton of freaking horsepower. We might just maybe do a few upgrades and then wait on. Oops, no, I'm not sure. Uh, and then wait and buy the turbo after a few races. I think that might be our best bet. Two thousand that adds quite a bit as well. How much does uh? Yeah, we'll go ahead and get this one. And then we'll spend the rest on um, some exhaust. Go ahead and get the first set of headers here. And uh, do we have enough for a transmission? Yes, we do. We'll buy a transmission. All right, sweet. So we're going to go down here to the second tier and go to uh, Red Pine River. Go ahead and see if we can beat that one real quick. We are at the Red River Run, I believe is what it's called. Red Pine River or something like that. And, uh, maybe we can win this one like we did the first one. The first thing here. I hope. Fast cars are fast as uh, I kind of expected them to be. Oh, there's a snowman right there by the gate. There we go. Don't, don't flip over. Don't. So many twists and turns.
Oh, somebody hit the snowman. There's this frail little body just laying there on the ground. If I could get over that bridge without actually wrecking it would help out so much. Alright, we're in the lead now. Got four laps here. It's kind of carrying on with me a little bit. Just don't don't spin me out, please. Um, I feel like there's a good shot that I'm probably gonna make a mistake and screw the race up for myself. Maybe not. Maybe I can uh, survive. Bridge and see if I can gain gain time that way. That was a bit of a mistake right there. I'm gonna spun her out. We'll just take it real slow over the bridge here. Yeah, that had to have gained some time. There's no way it didn't. Because you really gotta slow down to go around a lot of those little S turns through there. One lap to go. We'll just do the same thing this time. See how much of a lead we can have at the end of the race here. A little faster than I meant to go that time, but that's okay. I made it without flipping over. There's another snowman. I wonder if you knock over all the snowmans if you get something. There's another one up there on the hill. You know, like some games have secrets like that where you can knock over stuff. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Very nice. Sweet. And uh, I believe that um, that's going to do it for this episode. $4,000 in the bank. We win a couple more of those and we'll have enough for that supercharger. And uh, so in the next episode, we'll go ahead and see if we can get a couple more to get that supercharger. And uh, and we'll be halfway through the gold series already. This is actually going by quite a bit faster than I expected it to. So good for that. So uh, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for the continued support. And I will see you guys next time in the next episode. Have a good day. Bye-bye.